How's it going, everyone? Jesus64 here, and I just wanted to tell you today uh, about what happened. Um, I tweeted earlier, you may have saw it, but I almost got arrested today. Now, you may be wondering, how? How did you possibly almost get arrested? Well, so, on the side, when I'm not doing YouTube, I help block Senna campaigns, or, well, I help blocking for a senator today, whose name shall not be named, for reasons, but I was walking for a senator today, and uh, as I'm walking up, as I'm walking around, uh, we're at a, I just finished uh, talking to someone, dropping off the information, the literature, and, uh, in, like, I come around, outside, and around the corner, there's just two cops. And they both just walk right up to me, and they're like, Hey, uh, we have a couple questions for you. And I'm like, excuse me? What's happening here? And they were like, uh... Yeah, we had a... Person matching your description... Uh, earlier... Around the area, who was apparently... Uh, soliciting, which is not... Uh, which is illegal in Kansas, but... I was campaigning, which is not illegal because it's technically not soliciting. But anyways, uh, so I was doing that, and we were like, "Yeah, hey, yeah, we just need to ask you a couple questions and all that." Both of them are surrounding me. One has his hands on his handcuffs, which I noticed. But both of them are just surrounding me, and are like, "Yeah, we just have a couple questions. No big deal." And I'm like, "Oh, no big deal. Why do you have your hand?" I didn't say this, but I thought it. I'm like, why is your hand on your handcuffs then? But. So, they want to ask me a couple questions, and they ask uh, what I'm doing, and I tell them, I'm just campaigning. Oh, fuck that sniper, man. Oh, it's not even a sniper. It's, is there nothing? Oh, no, it's just two soldiers. Okay, but, but anyways, uh, there's just the two of them, and they're talking to me, and they get a call on the radio. Like, they're probably seconds away from arresting me because they say I match the guy's description almost exactly. But then they get a message on the phone or on the radio saying the guy's in a dark shirt and tennis shoes. Thankfully, my shirt that I was wearing at the time was light blue because it was a elect election shirt. It was a campaign shirt, but it was light blue, thankfully. And, uh... The cops... I missed. But uh, light blue and in tennis shoes. But thankfully, I was wearing flip flops at the time. So they're like, oh, it's not him. Which is good news for me. So they said, yeah, if, uh, if you see anyone matching your description, but with uh, tennis shoes and a darker shirt, just let us know. And so. Wait, the story gets better. Later on. We're walking again. We're go. We're walking back to our car. We're doing work, getting stuff done. I'm dead. But we're walking back to the car because we just finished walking around, and we see three cop cars pull up to one person, and this dude is like acting stoned out of his mind, and it's great. But, oh, one thing I forgot to mention before that: the actual sheriff came up to us and was like, hey, uh, have you seen someone you like this? Uh, he's been acting kind of crazy. We think he might be on drugs. Uh, just let us know if you, if you see him. And he says, hey, he kind of looks like you. Actually, he looks a lot like you. Sure you're not him? And I'm like, I'm, I'm fairly certain. I'm being followed. But, yeah, that's my story of just about how I almost got arrested today, everyone. Um... Uh, if you have any questions about it, leave them in the comment section below, I guess. And, uh, if you're new to the channel and you like this story, uh, make sure to leave a like and possibly subscribe, I guess. And